फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट एग्रीव्ड बाय द डिसीजन डिलीवर्ड बाय लर्नेड सिंगल जज डिसमिसिंग रिट पटिशन रिगार्डिंग मेंटेनेबिलिटी ऑफ द आर्बिट्रेशन प्रोसीडिंग्स यूनियन ऑफ इंडिया प्रेफर्ड रिट अपील एंड द डिवीजन बेंच डिसमिस्ड द सेम द मेन कंटेंशन एडवांस्ड बाय यूनियन ऑफ इंडिया बिफोर द डिवीजन बेंच वॉज दैट द क्लेमेंट्स हैड रिसीव्ड कंपनसेशन अमाउंटिंग टू रुपीज एटीन लैख नाइन्टी एट थाउजेंड अंडर द एग्रीमेंट इन फॉर्म के and therefore there did not exist any dispute as to the amount of compensation payable for the same to the owners for which an arbitration was required to be entered into in exercise of the power under section 81 of the 1952 act this argument was rejected by the division bench holding that there was no material on record to show that the claimants had communicated their acceptance to the offer made by union of india on the contrary the division bench found that when form k came to be executed the amount of rupees 14 lakh 80000 was accepted by the claimants under protest the division bench further found that union of india has never denied receipt of objections from the claimants at the time of receiving compensation in the circumstances the division bench found that there existed disputes between the claimants and union of india regarding the quantum of compensation and therefore it was not open to union of india to challenge the notification issued under section 81 of the 1952 act appointing the arbitrator the division bench agreed with the view expressed by learned single judge that form k contained clause 6 which itself stipulated that any dispute or difference in the matter of determination of compensation shall be decided by arbitration it was observed that in the present case union of india made an offer of rupees 18 lakh 98000 under the agreement dated 18th july 75 when the premises were under requisition and by such an agreement no right title or interest was ever transferred by the claimants to union of india therefore it was held that the notification under section 81 of the 1952 act was valid this was the main aspect to be decided by the division bench however when the writ appeal came for decision the award of the arbitrator had come into existence and therefore the division bench observed that the question of the validity of the award whether by consent or otherwise was not required to be gone into because the only question before the division bench was whether the notification issued under section 81 of the 1952 act was with or without jurisdiction the high court therefore did not go into the question of the merits of the award the high court declared that the notification under section 81 of the 1952 act was valid in law as there existed a dispute as to compensation between the claimants and union of india union of india thereafter preferred an application for review before a division bench of the high court against the judgment delivered by the earlier division bench of the high court stop